Welcome to BioAgriMix. I'm Jim Holliday, CEO. Here at BioAgriMix, we manufacture specialty feed medications. We've been here in Mitchell since 1983, and we've gone through three expansions since that time, and we're about to embark on our fourth expansion here in Mitchell, and we're really excited to be working with the municipality of West Perth on that initiative. So we've been here since 1983. In fact, our, our flagship building over on Wellington Street with the BAM etched in the brick over there is the one you'll be most familiar with. Most of the employees are native to the Mitchell area. I would say almost, in fact, almost all of them walk to work. If not, they have a very short commute. We've got a 4,300 square foot lab with 22 scientists or technicians that work down there. This is our main quality control lab. We do all of our quality control and research and development work in here. The other thing we do is we do a lot of work on the development of new products. Once the material is tested, it's released to production, goes through the production process, becomes the bags you see back here. So basically this is our incoming ingredient warehouse and our finished goods shipping warehouse. Once the product is uh, verified that it's okay, a release form is issued, that product can then be transferred to one of the three other facilities for the manufacturing goes over to the manufacturing, gets added uh, according to a batch record. And the customers really like it because the finished product, that nice granule, there's really no dust to it. So this is our small packaging area. Um, this is built to a much more pharmaceutical standard. As a local employer in the area, we're very proud that the majority of our workforce lives and works right here in Mitchell. And we're also able to pull uh, employment from the surrounding municipalities of Mitchell. So we are very, very pleased uh, to be expanding uh, right here in Perth County. We've found uh, Perth County to be a willing partner to support us in our expansion efforts moving forward.